Hello, I'm Patricia Immel. I'm an acupuncturist and we're here today at Wellspring Clinic to um, show you what an acupuncture treatment um, looks like and how um, what my personal style is. And we have a, um, a wonderful volunteer here, young man in his uh, mid-30s, and I'm treating him today. This is actually his second treatment. And I'm treating him for some uh, neck pain and some low back pain. And so we're going to be focusing on those two areas. But um, he also uh, has some allergies and uses his eyes a lot when he works. So I'm going to be treating him for his eyes here on his liver channel. And then this young man also works um, uh, at night, a graveyard shift. And so I'm going to um, treat him here also to um, just help nourish his yin, which gets um, consumed when um, people work at night. So we'll just help um, his well-being. Okay, so let's get started. Are you comfortable? Mm -hmm. Okay, great. I like to start with a little massage, just um, helps me fine tune the placement of the acupuncture. So we'll just see where he feels most tight and remembering what his muscles felt like last time and they are, they are looser. Actually quite a lot looser. And he reported that he had definitely had more range of motion in, in his neck and um, that he was just able to move about more easily. His back was not aching as much, so that's a great start after the first treatment. And, um, you know, he's a young man and um, youth does work for us. I've swabbed the points with alcohol that I've chosen to treat. Nice and easy here. Good. This is a wonderful point. It boosts um, immune function. It relaxes the mind. It tonifies the digestion. It invigorates the blood and um, relieves and soothes inflammation throughout the system. Nice and easy. Nice breath. There we go. How do those feel, sir? Don't know, so. Okay, great. It's normal to sometimes feel a little ache or a little tingle. Sometimes a pressure, but that it dissipates and it's not um, uncomfortable. One of the things we do with acupuncture is stimulate circulation. This point um, really brings a lot of nourishment to the eyes. It's on the liver channel. The liver um, opens on the eyes, we say in Chinese medicine. And um, it's helpful for night vision. And so many people, um, they um, strain their eyes. We're just using a lot, doing, having a lot more screen time in our daily lives. And we're seeing this in practice more and more that people are experiencing eye strain. And so acupuncture um, can really help nourish the eyes. These points are also good for the eyes and for the neck. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Good. A little tight in there, but that's to be expected. here at L5. Let's open that up a little bit. I think you would benefit from um, 
hanging upside down. Monkey bars. Four. When we treat the low back nice and easy here, we are treating um, often the kidney energy, which in Chinese medicine we recognize as the seed of vitality governing musculoskeletal health and strength. This also promotes healthy adrenal function. And while this young man's back, it feels a little bit tight, um, there's also a lot of strength in his little back. A little bit lower here. This is L5. A little bit lower, which is an extra, what they call an extra point in Chinese medicine, are the sacroiliac joints. I treated those last time. I'm going to treat them one more time, but they are much improved. This is the area where the pelvis and the lower spine come together. There's a lot of ligamentous material, and it's easy for it to um, be strained and be slow to heal. Yeah, this one's just a little tight. There, that looks great. With the first treatment, this young man, um, after the first treatment, actually during the first treatment, noticed that he had um, some aching in his knees. He experienced some aching in his knees and he um, told me about it and um, then told me that he had had uh, quite a history of injury uh, to, and trauma to both knees. And that will often happen in acupuncture as we increase the circulation through um, an area that's been injured or where the circulation isn't optimal, um, a person will experience achiness. This is a, a healthy response to um, moving the stagnation out of the area and improving the overall blood flow. Joints are um, an easy place where um, circulation can be compromised because um, there are a lot of bony prominences come together and also ligaments. So it's not like the muscles where you have a lot of um, blood vessels moving through the tissues. Nice and easy. This point is also a ruler point. It's called um, the ruler of the sinews. So this point helps all of the muscles and tendons and ligaments throughout the whole body function normally and also will help them heal if they're injured. This is also on the same channel as the points up here um, of the neck and upper shoulder. So it's just kind of providing a continuity of the treatment, um, treating below and, and above because we want to um, balance the overall treatment. All right, so all the needles are placed. We're going to um, step out and let them rest for about 15 to 20 minutes, and then we'll come back in and um, remove the needles and just check and see if there are any tightness, uh, any tightness in areas that remain, and, um, and we'll just take it from there. Okay, so we're back in. Chris has been resting with the acupuncture needles in. How are you doing, Chris? I'm doing great. Good. Did you relax well? I fell asleep. Perfect. Any um, sensations, um, achiness in the knees this time, or no? No, not, not, not this time. Okay. Nothing like an acu nap. Mm. Dr. Mark calls this the napatorium. Okay, so we're just going to take these needles out, nice and easy, here we go. A little release around this L5. I think this is going to be good for your low back. Rarely um, is there any um, blood when we pull the needles out, they're just so fine.
Looser in there at L5. That's going to be good. There's more. There's more that we can do here. So these deep muscles in the neck are tight, but the the more superficial ones are loosening up. That's where we have to start. You can feel this in here a little bit, Chris. How are these down? A little yeah. tight in there, huh? Yeah, they're a little achy. Okay. You know, I was, I'm thinking that, uh, yeah, I'm right in there. Next time we'll treat you face up. That'll be really nice. Okay. Yeah, that'll be good. This will loosen up. And we'll, we'll probably revisit this again in here through, through here sometime too. Well, this young man's responding very well to his treatment. This is his second treatment, and I can tell quite a difference in his muscles from, um, from what I'm feeling today, from when we started, and also he's reporting that he's um, feeling much better. We have another treatment plan next week, and, um, and then we'll just probably move to um, uh, like a maintenance um, approach. Maybe we'll see, to have a treatment once a month, and just see how he does with that for a couple months and we'll just take it from there. So um, thank you very much for letting us uh, share your acupuncture treatment and um, I hope you have a great response to this treatment and have a great week.